Hi, in this class we are discussing about the remaining task. So now this is the command task. So command task we can use for Unix and DOS commands to move the file or to copy the file, to delete the file, add, delete, copy, paste. We can use these commands. So just I'm creating a command here to move the file from one location to another location. So first see what are the files we have. Okay, here we have para.txt. This file I'm moving into the D folder. Okay, so move C colon backslash para.txt into C colon backslash D folder. Click on OK, save and run. Workflow, start workflow. So three uh, tasks are running. Okay, successfully completed. Just check whether the file is available or not here. So para.txt not available here. Okay, there is no para.txt in C location. Just go to D. Here we have para.txt. So like this we can move and we can copy, add and delete the fold, uh, files from one location to another location. We can use DOS and UNIX commands using command task. The next task is, so this one completed, decision, next, next task is assignment. Assignment we are using to create the variable values. So just I'm giving one example how we can use the assignment task. So first we need to create the variable. Go to workflows, edit, variables, create one. Okay count make it persistent then only it will store the value in the repository database okay so here first I'm using this assignment user define count so every time I'm incrementing the count plus one okay not here just a second I'll explain in detail so first we need to increment the assignment value here here user define every time I'm incrementing plus one okay for every execution so here I'm creating condition the first session status equal to succeeded sorry okay so when this session is successfully completed then only this assignment task will run then the assignment task value will increase okay for first execution the assignment value 1 for second execution the assignment value 2 like this it will increment the assignment value so here I am checking when first session is after first session 3 execution I want to run this session okay just go here and create condition when this count equal to 3 when the first execution is executed when that first execution is completed the three executions then this session will start so based on the depend 
dependency we we can use assignment task for example this is the weekly run okay so three times we can we schedule this one so based on this we have dependency for this okay when this first execute